So let's have a look at this front quad. Justin Kimon, the next rider. So let's have a look. Okay. Yeah. Let's look at it at a bit of a slower speed. So the descent looks pretty good. And you see there's the sticking point. Okay. Yeah, so that looks a bit ugly, let's say, especially at this point. Um, yeah, this is exactly, that's either, either a 1RM or close to a 1RM. And that's exactly the reason why we don't work with RM loads all the time. Because we just don't want to see that too often. So that's probably in the testing environment. Um, okay, so let, let's let's go through it. So you can see here, um, if I would point out something, maybe the elbows are already a little bit down, and that will then later result in the round back. So getting the elbows a little bit further up, if flexibility allows, that's definitely a good squat position, good back posture. So he reverses the movement, and you can see for him the most difficult part, this is the sticking point for him. And now you can see the weight also moves forward and results in, in a bit of a round back here. So the back is not straight, it's, it's round. And then he's able to recover from that. Yeah, so key points here, Got, that is fine, but then coming up, so the back position and the sticking point is around 90 degree knee angle. And we can see here the elbows are low. Yeah, so the elbows should be high and the forearms excuse me, the upper arms, this one, they should be parallel with the ground. So they are not parallel, that's very obvious. So they should be much rather like this, parallel with the ground. So a quick fix would be that, pointing out the elbow position. In the, in the next set, we could ask him, keep the elbows up. That could potentially prevent the round back here. But for me, that looks more like a strength issue. And that's why I said it's a 1RM attempt or a near 1RM attempt. So what you can see here is really where the sticking point is. So for him, the most difficult position is this one. And then this is where he gets stuck. And then also why the upper back rounds a little bit. But then he's able to recover and come back up. 